to having your point driven offline. Gary says I should pass again and strike with the Q end or the bot end of the spear. So if I put it in a throw, you just need a running pass for now. I want to make sure that I take the weapon outside. I don't want to just be here or down low where he can push his own thrust in against me or against me anyway. When I come, I want to take his weapon around my body so I don't get hit. Then I pass in with my left leg and I can hit with the Q end of the spear. Which we already said should be tipped with iron for that, for that purpose. And then uh, the plays on the left side are the same, except for one play where the uh, player is waiting to get true cross, and the opponent is actually gotten in close. He said, when it says, uh, player says, no fair, you're too close. But he passes back with the cover and strikes forward and puts his thrust. Knocks the, uh, does the exchange of points, knocks the opponent from one of the line and puts the thrust into the, into the space. of the spear plays. Is there anything else uh, that you want to show us over the past four? Any start to finish from the back, anything else that you'd like to go uh, One thing that I, I wanted to mention that I echoed over the word is that about the, the eight qualities of wrestling, he already talks about breaks and lines, but then he only shows, uh, uh, he shows one break in the wrestling, he doesn't show any lines, but I wanted to point, you could do any of the keys from uh, the dagger section in wrestling. So we get, get into like neutral wrestling positions. I can try and get upper keys, middle keys, any of those things in the shows in the dagger section are just as doable. I can try to get to the outside and go for arm locks. 